Like and subscribe right now or you're going to have bad luck for the rest of the week. 10 Deadliest River Monsters of the Amazon Have you ever noticed how there are so many animals around the world that are dangerous to us? Well, one of the most perilous areas to be in are tropical rivers, like the Amazon. So here are 10 animals that show you just how much you should avoid the Amazon. Let's get right into it. Number 10. Giant Leech One look at this giant leech and you will have nightmares for weeks, believe us. This big specimen was first discovered feeding inside of a young girl's nose who had recently bathed in the upper Amazon River in Peru, which isn't a pleasant thing to think about. From there, it was sent to the American Museum of Natural History in New York, where no one was able to figure out which family this leech even belonged to. Not many things were known about the leech, and it took two years for researchers to discover more information about it. It was found out that it feeds on mucous membranes, like noses on mammals, which includes humans as well. Unlike other leeches, this giant does not automatically let go of the skin after it had its share of food, but can hang on for weeks after the initial bite, if remaining unnoticed. Number 9. Green Anaconda Snakes are one of the most feared animal species on the planet. Of course, there are also snakes in and near the Amazon River. One of them is the green anaconda, which is also known as the giant anaconda. The word giant, though, isn't really comforting when you're talking about something as dangerous as deadly creatures. As with all other boas, the green anaconda is a non-venomous boa constrictor, which means that they kill their prey by constricting their airways. The green anaconda is the largest and heaviest snake on the planet and can reach lengths up to 5 meters and also weigh up to 70 kilograms. Their diet consists of fish, other snakes, and the occasional deer or capybara. Now, the green anaconda is the only snake that is able to swallow a human, and it has done so as well, though some people claim they aren't able to do so. But we definitely don't want to be the one to find out. Number 8. Payara This small predator can be found as our list suggests, in the Amazon in tropical South America. Just because the payara is small, however, that doesn't mean it doesn't pack a ferocious bite. In fact, this fish gets its nickname, vampire fish, from the dagger-like fangs it possesses. Bright silver in color, the fish puts those fangs to good use, using them to impale their victims. Known for their acrobatic jumps, lightning-fast movements, and brute strength, these fearsome little fish can actually grow to over 18 kilograms in weight and 1.17 meters in length. The payara, even though it is rather aggressive, is a popular aquarium species for large predator aquariums. In those aquariums, the vampire fish can only be paired with other large species because the smaller ones would become prey. Number 7. Sawfish Picture a shark with a long snout that has a flattened blade for its nose and studded teeth, and you'll know exactly what a sawfish looks like. The large-toothed sawfish, the one we are currently talking about, is the largest amongst them and can reach up to 7.5 meters in length, and large individuals have been found that weighed between 600 to 700 kilograms. But there is a possibility for them to weigh even more. They use their snouts in a swinging motion to hunt prey, and with a smooth strike, can stun their prey and opponents. The sawfish is sensitive to motion and can detect the smallest muscle contractions. If unlucky, wading through the Amazon can see you end up with multiple sharp teeth in your legs. Unfortunately, once common, their numbers are now declining due to overfishing and habitat loss, and they are now critically endangered. Number 6. Arapaima The Arapaima, also known as the Peroruku, is a large species of fish that is native to the Amazon River in South America, and they are among the largest freshwater fish in the entire planet. They can reach up to 3 meters in length and can weigh up to 100 kilograms. The largest recorded Arapaima weighed 200 kilograms. Their diet consists of fish, crustaceans, and smaller land animals that walk along the shore. It is a top predator in low water lakes when the oxygen drops and renders its prey weak, as the arapaima has the unique ability to breathe air when necessary. 
These large beasts may leap out of the water if they feel harassed, and you definitely don't want to be in the way of that. On June 17, 2009, two men drowned in the Chalakuti River, and locals claim that the Arapaima was to blame for it, which is known as the dragonfish in the area. Sadly, because of overfishing, the Arapaima is a critically endangered species. Number 5. Paku so, uh, who was going to tell us that there was a fish out there that had human-looking teeth? No one? All right, well, the Paku is actually related to piranhas, and their only difference is their teeth. Whereas the piranha has sharp, pointed teeth, the Paku has human-looking square teeth that are used to feed on plants and the like. However, the paka also grows larger than the piranha does. Overall, we really don't like the uncanny resemblance to human teeth. To have a paku bite you is rather uncommon, but their bite is powerful and dangerous, so it's not a good idea to pick a fight with the paku. Let's just be happy that this fish feeds on plants and not flesh. Number 4. Flat Cayman the black caiman is a large species of crocodilian and is, among the American alligator, the largest member of the alligator family. Native to the Amazon, the black caiman spends its days floating around in the brackish waters, waiting for its next meal to be naive enough to come close. As all other alligators and crocodiles, this caiman grabs its prey with a strong bite, pulls it back into the water, and drowns it in the process. Their usual diet consists of deer, tapirs, anacondas, and otters. Though it has been reported that even jaguars and cougars have fallen prey to the black caiman, though the predatory cats usually avoid areas with many large caimans. Unlike other caimans, this one poses a significant threat to humans and will attack when a person gets too close, though they do not actively hunt for people, thankfully. Number 3. Fool Shark Yep, sharks also live in the Amazon, unfortunately. It is really not a safe place to be for humans. Just too many things that are dangerous to us, you know? The bull shark can be found in both freshwater and saltwater due to specialized kidneys. Their diet consists of other small sharks, stingrays, and fish, though it can also include turtles, birds, and small mammals. Few freshwater attacks in humans have been recorded, but that doesn't mean that they don't exist. When humans stray too far from land and too close to the Amazon River's shore, it can happen that people get pulled into the water and bitten. Overall, when in the Amazon region, stay away from strange sounds, animals, and basically everything else. Number 2. Red-bellied piranhas The animal that the Amazon is most known for is the piranha. Known for its ability to smell blood from miles away and immediately rip everything apart in a large group of individuals, the piranha actually has a lot of lies surrounding it. For example, while the piranha's sense of smell is phenomenal, they don't actually go crazy at the scent of blood and don't storm towards it at all. They also don't ferociously rip humans apart. Though, piranhas really shouldn't be underestimated nonetheless. Their teeth are incredibly sharp, and their bite, just like the pakus, is powerful. Weirdly enough, out of all the fish you could keep in an aquarium, the red-bellied piranha is actually one of the most common piranhas to keep as a pet. We don't know about you, but piranhas as pets sounds both scary and super cool at the same time. Number 1. Poison Dart Frog you know, sometimes deadly things come in small packages, like the poison dart frog, for example. These brightly colored little frogs are incredibly dangerous and poisonous, and their colors act as a warning for predators, signaling that they are not worth eating. They are one of the most poisonous animals alive, and are so lethal that native hunters used to tip their hunting darts with their venom to make poison darts. Hunters from a tribe in Colombia regularly hunted birds, monkeys, and other animals using poison darts, taking the poison from the bright frogs to construct these deadly projectiles. The most poisonous frogs of this species is the golden poison frog, and this little guy has enough toxin to kill 10 to 20 grown humans. Other frogs of this species are still super poisonous, but pose less of a risk to humans. And there you have it, 10 deadliest river monsters of the Amazon. Did you think we missed anything? If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to be the first to be notified when we post. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.